Hi everybody, it's Ann Hass with VFIT and we are in week 8 of our Goal for It program. We're almost done. This workout today we called the Ooey Gooey Eyeball Workout um, because we were using some eyeballs in the workout but because you are doing this at home or this will be your at home version so you don't need any eyeballs. We are doing about 17 exercises for a minute each. After you do each exercise, you will do an abdominal exercise. So you'll do exercise one, then an abdominal exercise, then exercise two, then an abdominal exercise. But for the sake of space here and time, I'm going to go through the 17 exercises first and then show you the abdominal exercises. All right, here we go. First exercise, and all of these exercises are for one minute, except your abdominal exercises will be 30 seconds. So, first exercise is floor touch with a prisoner squat. Floor touch, prisoner squat. Again, we're doing this for a one minute. Floor touch, prisoner squat. That's exercise one. Number two, burpee with a jump across the room. So you wanna have some space. It's a beautiful day to get outside. You're doing a burpee with a jump and you're going across the room. Go so far and you can go back. Burpee with a jump. If you can't jump, you can do burpee with a step. You can modify. You can just do your burpee to a chair, just take a step and go again. Exercise three, elbow, elbow, hand, hand with eight mountain climbers. Looks like this, going down, elbow, elbow, hand, hand, then eight mountain climbers. And you're gonna be going one, one, two, two, till you get to eight and then elbow, elbow, hand, hand, eight more mountain climbers. Tough workout, that's for a minute. And then you would go to an abdominal exercise. Exercise four is high pull lunges. Reaching up nice and high, you're gonna take a step back into a reverse lunge and pull, pull, pull. You'll do 30 seconds on one side, pull, 30 seconds on the other side. Those are the high pull lunges. Then we have stuck in the muds. 30 seconds each leg. You have a staggered stance, one foot's in front of the other, and you're gonna move your arms as fast as you can, try to get out of the mud. And then you're doing that again, like I said, 30 seconds, and then switch legs. Stuck in the mud to get out. Then, exercise six. 30 seconds of squat ju jumps and 30 seconds of squat kicks. So we've done these. This isn't new to you. And then squat kicks, squat kicks. You're welcome to modify those squat jumps with just a touch. Then we have two minutes. It's a cardio segment. Easy out, hard back, find a nice space. You could do a full sight line if you have between your dining room, living room and kitchen. Outside, use your driveway. You're just gonna go easy out, turn around, come hard back. And you have five squats, one, two, three, four, five, and five pulses. And you're gonna keep doing that for a total of two minutes. Easy out, hard back, five squats, five pulses. Then having a little fun with our Halloween theme this week, we have zombie fast feet. So this is your zombie position. Let your arms hang and you're gonna go fast feet. And if you were like us this morning, you can growl or roar. So that's for 30 seconds. And then you're gonna be wacky Jackie for 30 seconds. Crazy Jacks, doing whatever you can for another 30 seconds to get that minute in. After that, we have 30 seconds of monkey donkers and 30 seconds of low kicks. Monkey donkers look like this, grab your ankles, squat down as low as you can and come up as high as you can. Just like that for 30 seconds, get low. You have low squats for 30 seconds. Low, stay low. So, as you can tell, you're gonna need a clock or something to keep track of your time. And that was exercise 10. Now we're on exercise 11, which is knee, knee, stand, stand. Looks just like this, knee, knee, stand, stand. So you'll lead 30 seconds. I'm leading with my right leg. Next 30 seconds, I'll lead with this leg, my left leg, okay? There you go. Now we're on exercise 12, which is an inchworm with a reach, reach. So excuse me, beep, beep, 
You're gonna walk out to an inchworm position. Reach, reach. Now walk your feet in this time. Stand up and you'll keep traveling, but for the sake of the camera, I'll just back up. Inchworm out, reach, reach as far as you can. Walk it back in and that would be for a minute. Then we have one, two, three laterals. Then down where your chest touches the floor. One, two, three. You're down. Chest touches the floor. Back up. One, two, three. Down. Chest touches the floor. And that's for a minute. Jumping jack toe touches is next. We've done these before. Full. Lateral. Lateral. I'm sorry, that was the easy version where you're stepping out laterally. And then we have sit up, push up, stand up. Just like it says, talk yourself through it. Sit up, flop over, push up, stand up. And you'll keep doing that for a minute. It's a fun one. Then we have another cardio segment, easy out, hard back. Same thing, use that same space you had before. You're gonna go easy out, turn around, come hard back. Then you have five squat thrusters. One, two, three, and you're doing five of those. Easy out, hard back, total of two minutes on that one. And the last one is squats with cross body reach. So squat, reach, reach. Doing this for a minute. All right, those are your 17 exercises now. In between each one, you're gonna be doing cardio. So we did exercise one, then we're gonna do plank. Plank for 30 seconds, just like this. Then you'll do that exercise two. Then we have sit-ups with a reach right and a reach left, and you'll do that for 30 seconds. Then you do exercise three, you have plank for 30 seconds. You'll have exercise four, and then you'll have sit up clap unders, just like this, sit up clap under. And then you have exercise five, go into plank, then you'll do exercise six, where you're gonna be doing V-sits. Hands face forward, they're lined up with your butt, drop down your elbows, extend your legs, come in, tuck it in, nice and tight. Then you do exercise seven, then you're on plank, then exercise eight, one-legged climbers. You're gonna sit up, walk it. You're doing that, stay on that same leg for 30 seconds. Then you'll do exercise nine, and you'll do the other leg. Walk it up, walk it up. Then exercise 10, guess what that is? Plank, you're right. Then exercise 11, and we're back to um, snow angels. Not back to, we haven't done these yet. Touch your pinkies underneath, Touch your thumbs overhead. You're trying to make that wide motion, make those beautiful angel wings. And then I think we're on exercise 12. And then we're back to plank, exercise 13. And we have bicycles. Bicycles. We've done these before. Then you have exercise 14. And you're back to that plank, just to show you again, plank. Then exercise 15, and we have sit up hip bumps. So you're gonna sit up, touch, touch. Sit up, touch, touch. If you want, you can alternate the sides that you're touching. Then exercise 15, we're back to plank. Exercise 16, um, sit up, toe touches. Just a normal sit up, we're gonna reach for your toes. And then exercise 17, you're back to plank. That took us about 50 minutes this morning, so it's a pretty good full length workout. Encourage your family to join you. It's a fun workout. Hopefully you can get outside. That completes week eight, routine number one. Um, we'll see you again in two days for exercise two of the week. And uh, wish you the best of luck.